Hola everyone, it's been a while since I used a Snapchat filter. I look good as a blonde. <laughs> Today is just kind of a short video to wrap things up We're in Tres Amigos, the RV park I've been staying at in Mexico for the last month or so. Um, I don't wanna go, but I need to go back to Canada and I'm excited about the drive home. I've got a friend coming with me and my mom's meeting me, so it's sad to be leaving Mexico, sad to be going back to cold Canada, but I am looking forward to another adventure. Enjoy today's video. Most of my stuff's packed up and ready to go. I leave tomorrow early, so this is my last, my last great morning on the beach and I'm gonna enjoy it. This has been an incredible month of reflection, an amazing adventure. I've learned so much and it's really, it's really hard to be leaving. I love my morning walks on the beach with Jasper. I know he's not going to enjoy the rainy weather back home either. It's been so great to have Chris here, and I'm super excited that he's driving home with me. Mago Blanco is doing phenomenal, and I can't wait to see what he thinks of cold Canadian weather. This really has been an amazing experience, and I'm just really glad that I did not quit, that I did not throw in the towel, that I came down here Despite my fears, despite my uncertainties, I did it and I'm proud of myself for that. I'm gonna miss these treats a lot. This has been my favorite, I don't know, Mexican candy. It tastes, I would say, kind of like a Twinkie, but it has raisins in it and chocolate on top. It took us a couple of hours and again, really grateful that Chris was here to help, but everything is packed up and ready to go. Now I can just enjoy the evening. Well, this is my last night here and I, you can probably hear the voices in the background. We're having a little bit of a happy hour and some drinks to celebrate me leaving. <laughs> I had a really amazing time. This last month I've done a lot of reflection and growth and I'm not really ready to go home but I know that I'm in a better place now a better person now and now I just got to figure out what's next I still don't know if the RV life is for me but being here being here with these amazing people and traveling has been fucking awesome and I think I just need to do some research and a little bit more learning because there is a lot, there is a lot to love about this lifestyle and I don't want to miss out on opportunities.